So, the Imperium of Man is, is a thing. Fucking 40k, though. That's what I'm supposed to... That's what I'm supposed to be fucking sorry. Fuck, I'm already fucking this up. So, one forty k is is shit. It's just fucking good. Um, this fucking minis assemble them, you glue them together because you're fucking weird, you know. And you don't get a girlfriend, you don't have a life, so you fucking glue plastic together. And you fucking prime it, you fucking decorate place. Yay, cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah you do that. You're cool. You make some cool looking minis. You paint good. You share them around interwebs, Instagram, fucking Twitter, and then you know people like your shit, and you feel somewhat fulfilled anyway but that's that's like the tabletop shit uh but one for the game is a great universe it's grim dark nah everything's fucking blah, uh, horrible everybody evil blah. it's a grim dark sci-fi universe that was written and made in the 80s so you know it's actually fucking good uh <laughs> meanwhile everything else that's made today is fun as shit Yes, the lore. The uh, lore. Before the Imperial Man, before everything, it was also the fucking Necrons. Necrons were glorious. They were fucking great. Um, not really. Everything sucked. They they were like lepers and shit. Everybody had it horrible. Like like fucking Necrons, man, were like fucking they give an entire species fucking made that that's Joe Biden and fucking uh what that shit in Congress. Nancy Pelosi, yes, it's just just that. That's the whole species. Everybody is either a bald Nancy Pelosi or fucking Joe Biden. That's that's all fucking Necrons. Just period. Even their children come out looking like fucking wrinkled, dead pus balls of fucking cancer. Like like imagine giving birth to a ball of fucking cancer. That's 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 it. And then it grows up to either be Joe Biden or fucking Nancy Pelosi. You know, it's just a perfect society, really. <laughs>